Tip your hat. Uh, you know, Christy does a good job with that team, and I thought they came in here well prepared. And again, uh, you know, we uh, we let Wake have, uh, I guess I'm saying that right, have 23 points, and that's disappointing. You know, we knew she could shoot it, and we just didn't do a good job, have the, quite the urgency we needed to get to her or the switch or whatever. So we still got a lot of things we need to clean up, but did like the way we were able to turn them over some, get out and run some. And uh, that's how we want to play. So, uh, again, it's good. We need a break. I think it's a good time. We've got finals now and don't play again until next Sunday. So, be able to give them a couple of days off, a couple of days of just weights and individuals uh, before we start practicing, getting prepared for uh, Liberty next Sunday. Go ahead with questions. So, how do you, you want your team, you said you're going to have some individuals, one on ones at Zambra. Do you think they're, they're equipped to handle it? I know there were times last year you wondered if your team were doing the right things during those gaps. Yeah, that's why we're only doing one day off at a time. Uh, you know, we want them to stay around here. Uh, we did have a, a year or two ago, had somebody take off and go to California, so that wasn't exactly what we wanted to do. So we'll be off tomorrow. We'll do individuals Tuesday. We'll be off Wednesday. We'll do individuals Thursday. If they can get to California and that, God bless them. How do you navigate this month? I mean, it's only like three games until Virginia. I yeah, uh, again, like I said, we've been going at it and traveling and all that. So uh, it'll be good. You know, what we like to do, we like to have a couple of days to prepare for each opponent. So, you know, during finals, they got finals uh, Wednesday through Friday, I think. You no, know, maybe it's Thursday and Friday. Thursday and Friday finals. So we'll practice Friday and Saturday getting ready for Liberty. And, and uh, then we'll have a game. Uh, game day off and and of course we're going bad day we're going on the road for the last couple which I don't know how smart that was but South Florida obviously has had a really good program and then Old Dominion too great tradition so we're going on the road playing a couple of really good programs uh, down the stretch. What do you do to, to get so many of the high percentage shots today? It's going to get a lot of those. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, again, I, I think uh, transition helps, you know, and, and then we got the ball inside. I thought River did a really good job on the block, and then we also posted Mimi up some. Mimi's really good down there. So, you know, at the forward position, forward, if they go small, she can really go down there and get a lot done. And, and if they try to go bigger, then she's shooting the three really well right now. So good balance with her. But yeah, I thought we did a good job penetrating and, and uh, kicking or dishing. And then, like I said, just getting the ball inside, getting post touches. On um, days like today where there's so many alumni in attendance, and, you know, they had the ceremony out on the court at halftime, yeah. do you ever get to take a second before or after the game and be like, man, it's pretty cool? Yeah, it's neat. Uh, you know, you owe a lot to that to Kay Yao and her, her history here and the tradition. So yesterday we were able to – uh, we had the former players, all of them that were here, come to practice yesterday morning, and then be able. We had a, a big luncheon uh, for them as well with our with our current players also, and so uh, it was. It's really nice for the eras to kind of connect and get to know each other, and because they do share, you know, this experience here at NC State together, and so really neat. Our our uh, administration's really good about promoting things like that, so. Uh, it's, it's a special weekend. Your overall thoughts on Illinois State, is this a team that can really help you guys with the RPI or net or whatever? That's always what we try to do. You know, I, you look at who we play, I mean, we, for the most part, we're, we're really trying to get somebody with a great uh, net that's going to help us. We try to have the best net in the ACC every year is our goal, and uh, you got to play people. And then also, uh, you know, they're going to do things that challenge you and are going to prepare you for some of those same uh, same things uh, when we get in the ACC co uh, turn, uh, conference play. So, uh, yeah, again, we knew they were good. And she's a former World Packer. Yeah. Oh, that's former. what made it special. Yeah. You know, to have the, we had one reason they had the reunion this weekend was she was on the Final Four team. So, yeah, she'll be here in a second. And, uh, you know, you can, I'm sure, ask her about those things. But I thought that was pretty neat. You have anything else with Coach?